This is the... I don't fucking know what it is. Then... Oop. Limbs. I know that one. Very nice. Bowstring. I wonder how I know that. Gloves. A... Bowstringer. That'll come in handy because I have no clue how to string a bow. Arm guard, I yeah, that's definitely yeah, that's arm guard. The arrows, the murdering tools. Mm. I have a knife somewhere. What am I doing? I brought you a little snack. Mmm. Mmm. Mm -hmm. It's a nice little way of packaging it. Look at that, all stick together and everything. Wouldn't want that going in ya. Ow! Sharp to the touch. Don't know why I expected it to be blunt. <laughs> we got a thing. Does many things. Looks like everything. Okay, let's start with this part. One. Two. Now we will put on the limbs. Um, do these have a specific, oh geez, I have no, what I, no idea what I'm doing. Let's have a look and inspect. Ooh. Inspect. You look the same. Shit, I should probably look at a tutorial. What am I doing? I want to congratulate you on your selection for the Samic Sage Recurve Bow. Ooh. I truly believe it's the best value and quality for your money on the market today in recurve bows. I'm gonna... Oh shit, went oh. too far. Okay. Are we insane? That's not look right. Okay, figured out what was wrong. So you do attach both of the limbs like that. But I was thinking it looks stupid because the string goes up there and then you're holding it on this side so the string would be away from you. But when you string the bow, it pulls all the limbs back. So yeah, I'm a dumbass. Okay, the hard part. I was strung, took an embarrassing amount of time, um, and stalled. Sam focus? Mm -hmm. Knocking point, so you know where to clip the arrow, and a really, really shitty arrow rest. It was like a crappy kindergarten art class trying to stitch that thing together. I'm terrible with the scissors. Sandbags, sit up down there. It's gonna simulate a rabbit and then cardboard box that the whole kit came in. It's actually quite a nice target, so don't have to spend 70 bucks on one of those fancy ones. I'm gonna set up the GoPro right next to the target so I can see the arrow hitting it. If I shoot this thing, I'll be upset. It's gonna be such a pain trying to retrieve the arrows. Our backyard is literal swamp at the moment.
gonna keep practicing every day. And you, you fucking watch me. A couple of weeks and I'll be shooting like goddamn Lars Anderson. So it's been a month since I got my bow. Been shooting it a lot and uh, Miller really liked shooting it but she had a lot of trouble with it because it was a left-handed bow so it was pretty awkward to fire. So it was her birthday and I got her a bow. It's 32 pound draw weight. We need to string this. And I absolutely hated string the last one so <laughs> good practice I guess. <laughs> Alright so there's two loops on the end of the string. One's bigger, one's smaller. The big loop According to the internet, I'm not a professional. Big loop always goes at the top of the bow. Okay, so it's all wiry at the moment. And again, according to the, the internet, the guy said you have to rotate the string, I think, 30 times. Okay, uh, 30. And then you slide it along like this, the big loop. Then you get the little loop, put that on here. And then, yeah. <laughs> this goes over the top here. Okay, and then what you do is stand here and then that'll pull the bow into place. Now I'm going to string it, if it breaks, then I'll cry. Oh, I'm really scared to see it snap. That took so long on my last bow. That took me about an hour because I really did feel like I was going to break the damn thing. Um, but hers and I are the same. They're both ceramic, and the riser, which is the middle piece, they're both like pretty much identical. But the handle is so much better built, and it feels so much nicer to hold this handle compared to mine. It's way less blocky. So lucky you. <laughs> All right, let's fire it. I said I was going to use cardboard boxes, but those things turn into pancakes after a, a little bit of use. Like, they just get absolutely shredded by all the arrows. So, this will be much better for the arrows. And it looks cool. Woo! Alright. What's that? Is that a bug? There's a stone in my glove. I don't know how that got in there. <laughs> if it was a bug, I would have shrieked. <laughs> yeah, I thought, thought it was a really hard spider. Oh, nice. <laughs> Shut up. So it's sitting at a 90 degree angle on the um on the string knocking point. And you put that on there, hold it in place, and you get these. 
And now you have a knocking point. Thank you. And now if you put in your arrow. Put it in below that. <laughs> we found the same thing. Trick shot! <laughs> yeah, trick shot. Hang on, you want to use my quill? Okay, okay. Yes. Yes. Does it match my glove? Yeah. Alright, now do a little rotate. Cute. Yeah. <laughs> oh, nice. Do a little bit of a walking shot. A walking shot. 